Hello and welcome to another gloriously sunny edition of Dream Deals, the programme that tells you everything you've ever wanted to know about your favourite car manufacturer and some things you probably didn't, as well as giving you helpful real-world advice on how to get your hands on your very own Dream Deal. This week we're looking at a manufacturer whose name is synonymous with wealth and luxury, a manufacturer whose history is steeped in motor racing success. Who am I talking about? Well, there's a few clues. Mercedes-Benz. Gottlieb Daimler and Karl Benz were only born 60 miles apart in southern Germany. Because of their differing approach to car manufacture, it's thought the two never met, and it is a little known fact that Daimler, generally known as the father of modern automobiles, never liked to drive, if indeed he ever learned. The two companies, Daimler and Benz, merged on the 28th of June 1926, creating the company we know today, Mercedes-Benz. The name Mercedes was first given to a special car made for Emil Zielnek, a wealthy racing driver of the time, who named the car after his daughter. After the merger, a symbol was chosen for the combined products of DMG and Benz. The new insignia was a three-pointed star wreathed with laurel, with the words Mercedes at the top and the Benz at the bottom. The new company did well after the merger, and production rose to nearly 8,000 cars in 1927. That year also saw the first two cars to sport the Mercedes-Benz badge. They were the Stuttgart and the Mannheim. The cars of the 1930s produced great racing success. The silver metal bodywork gave rise to the name Silver Arrows when the W25 racer had the white paint removed to lower its weight. The W125, with a top speed of 200 miles per hour, won seven out of 13 races in 1937, followed by the even more successful W154. 